Hello, may God bless you all in the name of Jesus. In a few, it's going to be midnight here in Toronto. And I invited those to watch this video, those who want to do more for God, to be more for God, to do more for God, to have more. They, they, they have this desire, my God, I want more. But not for themselves, no. But they want to be more used by God. They, they know that God has more for them. That the life that they live does not fully do or match the plans of God. And they want more. They have the desire to do more for the work of God, to do more for God himself. And as I arrived home today from the church, I was meditating on this. And I want to read together with you. If you have your Bible close by, in the book of Philippians, chapter 2, verse 13, it says like this. For God, it, for it is God who works in you, both to will and to do. Both to will, the desires that we have, and the, to do. For his good pleasure. My friend, I think like this and this is what I have been praying since yesterday. And I truly believe in this. That it was God who put the desire in us for us to have more. Have more of his presence. I'm not talking about material things. But that includes, is included in, in the plan of God. But for us to be more, more of a beacon in this world for him, to be an instrument in his hands to save more souls, to make him, his kingdom grow more and more. And in these next days, as we live our lives, I want you to have this in your mind. My God, I want more. I want more of your spirit, more of your presence. It's, that's why I made this prayer in midnight, because not everyone, not everyone wants more. Not, not everyone is willing to do more for them to be more, so God can use them more. And this prayer at midnight, it's for these kind of people. People that say, my, my God, I want more. I desire more of you. And this, my friend, is what we are going to pray. This is what we are going to determine right now. That the Holy Spirit is going to come and use you more and save. And through you, salvation will reach others. You know, through your life, through, through your testimony, through the way you walk, the way you talk. Something more is going to happen. We said in the end of the year that this year would be the tree of life. And you who believe in that, you who have this spirit inside of you, know this. This year, God has special things for us, okay? So right now, let us pray. Let us talk to God. Let us call upon Him. And let us ask Him for more. More of His spirit, more of His presence, more faith, more courage for us to do whatever it takes, okay? If you can, close your eyes, please. Let us talk to God. My Lord and my Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus, my Father, I call upon you right now. And I ask you, my Lord, to visit those who right now, they have this desire inside of them. My Lord, they don't know how, they don't know when, how, where it's going to be, but they want more of you. They want to be more for you. They want to serve you more. They want to do more. So they can glorify your name even more. So Holy Spirit, come upon them. Come upon these people right now. You said that you work in us both to will and to do. So my Father, we are willing. Now make, make it happen, my Father. Make it happen. And now in this month of April, my Lord, let it be the month that we are going to save more souls. That through our lives, we're going to reach more people through our testimony, through our example. 
Lord Jesus, I cry out to you right now, together with all of these who are praying with me, that you may touch their lives in such a way that they are going to have more testimonies. More testimonies, my Father, to give, that they are going to be able to speak more about your power, about your presence in their lives. Oh, Holy Spirit, come upon these people right now. I cry out to you right now. It's in the middle of the night and we are here, my Lord. Many could be sleeping already, but they they chose to be here. They, they made this decision, my Lord, because deep inside of their hearts, they want more of you, Holy Spirit. So come right now. Come with your presence. Come with your power. I determine, my Lord, that we are going to have more of you, more of your presence. In Jesus Christ's name, and those who believe in that say, Amen. Amen, my friends. This is it. You know, in these next few days, I'm going to be posting more videos, speaking about doing more, being more. And as this week, we are doing the attack, attacking hell, attacking the devil. We are not going to wait for the devil to attack us, no. So be with us this Sunday, the Sunday of attack. Let us... Let us take position, spiritually speaking, against the hell. And let us focus in receiving and fighting for the promises of God. Okay? May God bless you all. In Jesus' name.